Hey guys, what's up? It's Mr. Ninja here. Today we are back on Subnautica, and I have just realized what those eggs hatch into. They turn into little land sh uh, sand sharks. So, uh, that's interesting. Also, um, it appears that my fish have overpopulated in here, so I'm going to have to get them more stuff, more uh, containments, uh, areas, alien containments. But, as I said last time in the last episode, uh, we are going to be building a base today. Now, I've already got started slightly because I had a couple uh, issues with recording. I caught it early, so we don't have an issue there. Um, you'll just simply see what I've already done, and uh, it's not really that, that brilliant. It's just, you know, corridors and and the, the main things. But, nonetheless, here we are. Um, I needed to make this because I had a glitch that I was going to get rid of. Alright, now we go. And, apparently you need a lot of batteries for this because this thing runs out of power really, really quick. Okay, so I believe I am now officially good for everything. I should have some titanium on me, which is good. And, we'll keep going. So, what I did is I went off and I collected a whole bunch of resources. I'm, I'm not talking like a few resources. I mean a lot of resources. So hopefully we won't run out of any titanium Welcome anytime soon. Oh, uh, thank you, Maria. Um, as you can see here, I have tons of titanium here. Behind it, I have walls and walls and walls and walls of titanium. I have made about a billion trips, uh, or short of, or slightly short of a billion trips. So let's see here. This is where I was at. And that's that. I need to get some water, which is right there. This one. Let's do that. And there we go. Alright, and my tree has grown. I, I planted the tree a little bit ago, and it, it's grown. <laughs> Alright, so what we're going to be doing is going to be making kind of a circle slash rectangular direction around this water source. And then I want to come right off of this one and go above the water and go straight down. That's the goal, at least. And if it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, we'll, <laughs> we'll see eventually, I guess. So, corridor coming right up right here. This may be slightly more boring than my normal episodes because all I'm doing is building and I can't really, can't really do too much. I just want to show you what I'm doing and I uh, hope you guys enjoy it. But I like, I like building bases, so... There we go. Especially when it comes to making really, really cool stuff. Okay, so the issue I have here is I need to get to that side at some point. So maybe I could make a, a hatch right here. Why did that go away? There. Oh, my God. oh I don't have a I don't have any glass. Well, I will make a hatch right there because, ooh, I also need to get in the middle, though. I'm going to leave this one. I'm just going to leave this one open for a split second because I need to not lock myself out or in, depending on how you look at it. I need a little bit of glass, and that should be good. I think I need one glass for each... Um, each hatch. Pretty sure. So, for the time being, I believe I should make another hatch on this side. Just in case I get stuck in the middle or lost or anything. I don't want to fall in the middle because that doesn't look like something I can actually just walk out of. And I have an idea on how I can work around this. So that I won't actually fall in the middle, but be able to stand over top of the, the water for the time being. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to make a foundation right. Oh, I was going. Oh, there, there we go. Make that. Make it slightly started, and then I can just delete it later. Should I make a glass one? 
if I made a glass, it'd be kind of look, kind of cool. Look down and go, oh, there's the water and stuff. But at the same time, there's not really that much in here. It's just a, a square thing. If anything, I make those glass because I'm gonna put a garden over there. Yeah, I don't really think I need glass here, so I'll just use a regular corridor. Do that. Can I... Can I do this? Please. There, that's, that's what I was trying to do right there. Corridor, coming right up. I'm out of titanium. <laughs> Probably should have looked at that prior to whatever, but... Nonetheless, we're going to go in here, grab more stuff... And go back out. Mm, glass. Titanium. Ooh! I can make from the inside. That's really cool. I didn't know I could do that. That's actually quite nifty and quite handy, too. So... Okay, I need I need this to be slightly started so that I can do Should I do that or should I do I could do that and have a corridor come from both sides here and then each of these little areas could be power perhaps? I'm not 100% sure. I don't know why I would ever need that much power. Okay, so there's that, and then I could have an observatory right here if I wanted. I guess I could have an observatory up top. All it would be is just kind of observing my my main base, but it's not a terrible idea. I don't believe I have any more glass, do I? I don't have any more glass on me. So, yeah. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to... I'm gonna grab some glass, because that's kind of important. Because without a way back in, uh, it would not be any mean. It would not be any fun at all going down. This is like, this place is a lot bigger than I thought it was gonna be. I guess it's gonna be huge. Um, it's my castle, quote unquote. Mmm, glass, glass. I think one glass is good enough. All I need is one for a quarter or a uh, hatch, right? Yes, one glass for the hatch. And then I want to make it in such a way that I can always go and put my sea moth in. That's the thing that I'm kind of wondering about right now is where can I put my sea moth? How does that work? Um, I'm sure there's some sort of bay I could put it in to. Okay, what is going on there? I can't walk through that way. That is extremely strange. That's a glitch in my base so far. <laughs> Probably could have taken a shortcut right through the middle, like. Should have thought about that, but whatever. That's going to be an issue if I if I can't um, work around that. So I'll have to do that next. Not next. It, there's nothing there. I don't know. That is quite odd. Alright, so I have enough for that. I just got to make sure that I keep enough titanium on me at all times. Which I probably should have grabbed more titanium. Just a second. I will be right back. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna do this because this seems smart to me. Boom. There. I'll make a bunch of hatches right here so that I can always get out. Multi-purpose room coming right up. It goes directly underneath the first one. All right. That's that's good. That goes there. And we're gonna keep going down. I don't actually know how uh, tough my base is yet. I know I can add more uh, 
platforms at any point. So it shouldn't be too hard to work with. I also have absolutely no idea how long it's going to take to get down that way. Is there something I can use to get down there faster? There's a vertical connector. I don't really know what it does, but it's a vertical connector nonetheless. Oh, fudge. <laughs> can I get out of it? I can't get out. Okay, so bad idea. Let's go back down here. Get two of that and put a hatch in, right? Right there. Oh, I can't put a hatch right there because I don't have any titanium. Well, maybe I can. Welcome Do I have enough captain. for a ladder? Ladder, coming right up. Why is there water right here? I don't get that. I really don't. There's like not water here. There is water there, and then there's no water there. That's odd. There better not be something huge that just comes up and eats me. Could you imagine that? Just sitting there and do 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 building my base, and then huge teeth just come around your ugh. Come around you scare me so much is what that do. That would just terrify me. I have no idea what to do. I'd just die, I guess. <laughs> this is gonna take forever to get all the way down to the bottom. But we'll do it. Nonetheless. Might take a long, long time, and I might actually have to cut this. Build reinforcements to remove weak parts. Or remove weak parts. Okay, that is something I'm going to have to think about. Um, is there some sort of wall or protection I can put on here? I'm sure there is. Vertical connector, observatory window, I don't need the obs- Ah, here it is, reinforcement. Okay, so I need lithium, which... Fortunately, I believe is down here. Oh! Oh boy, that's not good. something I did not know about. I don't think it's going to be anything too permanent, and I have a welder, so it's not like I can't fix it. It's just a matter of it's it's falling apart. <laughs> and uh, I'd prefer not lose my entire place because it fell apart. So we'll, do, we'll take care of that in just a second. There's, 80 th there's 84 holes in it? Oh, jeez. Let's see. Where's my lithium? My lithium was like... Ah, there's my lithium. 117 holes, 118 holes. Why can't I walk over that? That's not that big a deal. Okay. Um, lesson learned. Don't uh, don't do stuff till it's ready. I guess. And just take a little bit of charge. That's that's all it's gonna take for me. But I'm gonna I'm gonna put some. I'll use this and where is my thing at? I'll put reinforcement right here. Because reinforcement does what now? It brings it up by seven hit points. I don't know what, if this is helping me or hurting me in the long run. Ah, 14 plus. It's now a total of 12. So all I really gotta do is just make sure I put lithium on the top as I work my way down. And I need more titanium. And I'm gonna have to get a whole bunch of uh, titanium at some point here because that's not necessarily good. And I'm going to have to get a battery to weld everything and, yeah, whatever. It's not that big a deal to me. Hull integrity restored. Draining systems initiated. 
Oh, really? They are they're like all ready, or how does that work? Doesn't appear to be all ready. I'm gonna keep working my way down until you know I, I get eaten by something massive, which I sure hope doesn't happen. But I'm going right into the depths of who knows what. I love how it's finally telling me the hull integrity. It didn't tell me that prior to you know dying. Not dying, losing a bunch of stuff in it. I don't actually care all that much though, because how much titanium do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six. That's three floors, I believe. So I'll just do one more multi purpose room here. And then I'm gonna go up and get more uh, multi purpose stuff. Of oxygen remaining. Oh, yeah, that's right. We're underwater. That is all the titanium in there. Alright, we'll take all the titanium out of this one then. And start on this one. Work our way back downstairs. And hopefully not die. Tragically. I'm not exactly sure what it's doing in there. That's all blue. So I need to go down here. Not with that. Although that thing is really cool. If you put it next to a whole bunch of stuff, it'll pull it all next to it. Put a hatch here. And then right here. Um, ooh, hold up. Which way? I'm right here coming through, so I need to go... Okay, I gotta figure out where the ladder is because I want to go straight down with the ladder all the way down. So if that's one, this is two, this is three. Right here. That should be all I need at the moment. Oh, I can go down with my ladder. That's gonna be way easier. That'd be way, way, way easier. Alright, let's do this. Well, this real quick. And finished. Take care of this one. Alright, so guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm going to keep going down. Um, for some odd reason, it's... Uh, it's not for some odd reason. This is a lot deeper than I thought it was. So I'm going to keep going down and I'm going to dig all... I'm not dig. I'm going to go all the way to the bottom and then I will be back to uh, basically go over what I what I found and what I didn't find. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to leave that double thumbs up down below. It really helps a lot. And I will see you in the next one. Um, and hopefully by then this... Um, I don't know what you would call this, if you call this a castle or, or whatnot, but we'll be at least almost finished by then. All right, I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> you actually, you made it three quarters of the way. That was Big good. Big props to good you. Good job. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, we got polar bears, too, which are really white. We got brown bears. We got black bears. Like, what other bear could you possibly ask for, you know? I love your whole bear conversation. <laughs> really, we're really proud of the bear diversity that we sport in our park.